Old people are warehoused? Well, I don't want to be warehoused. If I can run 100 miles in one day, I can do anything. Born on June 6, 1930, Lou Hollander defies the stereotypes of an average senior citizen. As an accomplished scientist and physicist, he could have easily opted for a quiet, comfortable retirement. However, Lou uncovered a newfound enthusiasm for fitness that would change his life and set him on an extraordinary path. At the age of 55, Lou said it's never too late to be healthy and competed in the grueling Western States 100-mile foot race in the High Sierras. This experience ignited his passion and led to over two decades of international triathlon competition. At the age of 82, he took on the extreme test of human endurance, the Ironman Triathlon, covering an insane 140 miles of swimming, cycling, and running. And he didn't just finish it, he conquered it, securing his place in the Guinness Book of World Records as the oldest person in the world to complete the strenuous race. And he hasn't stopped since. With thousands of triathlons under his belt, together with 70 Ironman distance races, Lou is a living legend in the world of endurance sports. He's also a champion long distance horse racer with a list of awards that would make any athlete jealous. He's won the Ochoco 150 mile race and been awarded the Hall of Fame for the American Endurance Ride Conference. Lou is also an enthusiastic mentor, sharing his wealth of knowledge and experience with young athletes and ambitious triathletes. At an age when most people are satisfied with merely taking it easy, he continues to push the boundaries and encourage us all to never give up on our dreams. But what's truly remarkable about Lou is his modest attitude. He looks around at others and wonders why they can't do what he does, never once taking his own extraordinary accomplishments for granted. He's become the face of the senior health movement an inspiration to all those who believe that age is just a number. In an interview, the scientist said, you were designed to die at 35 or 40. Your pituitary slows down hormone production. You stop repairing. You stop replicating cells. You get old and you die, okay? That's the plan. And we don't like that plan. According to Lou Hollander, your habits and routine at 40 determine what you can do at 80. While death is unavoidable, you have control over the quality and length of your life. In fact, in his 90-odd years, he firmly believes that his best years are still ahead of him and sets his sights on living to be 120. And in his words, if you want to be 120, you've got to get your ass up and go. It's that simple. Lou Hollander swears by particular principles for his longevity and success. Every day, Lou participates in anaerobic exercises as a vital and key part of his training regimen. He says, you do it every day until you can't breathe. You run as hard as you can. The next time, run a little farther until you clear your anaerobic threshold. Look at me, no pain. Every morning I jump out of bed with no joint pain. None. You know why? I run up this hill every day with this beautiful lady, Hollander said, while pointing to the steep ridgeline next to his property with one arm and wrapping the other around his wife. He also highlights the significance of eating a healthy diet with fruits, vegetables, and supplements and setting attainable goals. He says, you are what you eat. Nutrition in the wide sense is what keeps us alive. I won't touch anything I can't recognize. Lou also instructs keeping a check on calorie consumption to stay fit and trim. Lou's greatest and ultimate judge is the mirror. If he gives it his all and can look at himself with satisfaction, he knows he's on the right track. There's no space for giving up when you have to face the mirror every day. Here is his confession. Persistence is key to my life. You fall down, you get back up and you go again. I don't give up. That's been my motto in business and science. I've never been really good at anything. 
I just stay with it. As Lou approaches 93, he still feels good, and that's what he's most proud of. This summer, he'll be racing across Oregon, taking on 5Ks and sprint marathons with the same determination and enthusiasm that he brings to every challenge. So there you have it, folks. Lou Hollander's secrets to youth and longevity. Go hard, keep pushing, and who knows, maybe one day you'll run a triathlon too. <laughs>